Hello guys, this is James from Tech Room Solution. Today's video guys, I'm going to show you how to receive or send text messages in your computer. So this is going to be useful guys, especially if your phone is somewhere else like for example, I'm charging my phone on my bed but I still need to send or receive text messages while it's charging. So I don't need to worry about that because I'm still going to be able to receive or send text messages while in front of my computer. So let me show you how to do it. First, go to your phone, go to Google Play Store, then you need to download this app. Just type message by Google. The app you want to install is this, the first one. Install it to your phone. After the installation, open it. So the first time you open it, it might ask you if you want to set the app as your default for messaging app. Just choose yes or okay. So now the app is installed in your phone. Next is to go to your computer. Open your favorite internet browser, then go to this link, message.google.com. I'm gonna put the link inside the description box, guys. Then click message for web. We need to scan this QR code using the phone. So back to your phone, then tap this three little dot button right here, then message for web. Tap QR code scanner. Then let's scan out the QR code in the computer. Oh, that was quick. So now I can see my phone messages in my computer. So whatever you update in your phone or in your computer message, it's gonna be a real-time update as long as both the computer and phone is connected to the internet. So for example, I'm gonna send a message in my computer. I'm gonna click start chat. I'm gonna send a message to my brother. I'm gonna say, hey. As you can see, it also appear in my phone message right away. Cool, right? Remember guys, you can also turn on settings so that your browser will remember this computer so that you don't have to scan the QR code when you go back and use the message for web again. To turn on, just click right here. Then settings, then turn on remember this computer. Anyway, you can also turn on dark theme if you want. Cool, right? In my phone, I don't think that I have a dark theme settings in Android message app. But I can turn on the dark theme by sliding down the notification center. Then hit dark theme. There you go. So that's it guys, Sam. That's how to receive or send text messages using your computer. So by the way guys, if you like my video, hit thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe for more videos. Thank you for watching guys, have a nice day and see you in my next video. Bye bye.